last episode, the Decepticon stole the key to the plasma energy chamber, the forge where the Autobots were created millions of years ago. The Autobots regained the key, but a blast of plasma energy blew the Autobots clear across the galaxy. They crashed on the planet Nebulos and were captured by Nebulon rebels who feared that the Autobots were controlled by the evil rulers of Nebulos known as the Hive. But after the Decepticons landed on their planet and waged a brutal battle taking five of the Autobots prisoner, the Nebulon rebels agreed to help the remaining Autobots. And so, with danger looming from every side and his son Daniel gravely wounded, Spike attempts to unite the Nebulon rebels and the Autobots into a new life form, the Headmasters. Ah, there, finished. Okay. Duros, you're our combat veteran. Which Autobot do you want to bond with? I'll take Hardhead. Him and me should get along just fine. Arcana, you're the wisest and oldest among us. Who do you choose? I choose Brainstorm. His mind is undisciplined, but I find his youthful ideas most refreshing. How about you, Mr. Stylor Man? I'll take Chrome Dome. Oh, that leaves me with Highbrow. Not my first choice, but he'll do. And the last one's reserved for my boy, Daniel. Easy, son. <sighs> Now, hold on tight. Wow. I'm sure RC will take good care of you. Nebulons and Autobots, prepare to merge. <laughs> hey, Duros! Welcome to the club. Glad to be aboard. How you doing, RC? <laughs> Hope you don't mind carrying me around like this. <laughs> you know I don't, Daniel. It's weird. I feel like we're a part of each other now. I know. I feel it, too. Hey, eyebrow, what's happening? I got stuck with you? I was hoping for someone who at least approached my own intellectual capacity. Well, I'm not too thrilled about the accommodations either, but we've got bigger things to worry about. This is great! I can't wait to give those rotten hive machines a major pounding! Great, huh? You call me Strangled Great? Rip off one of the tentacles! I'm trying! I'm trying! One clear shot down that hole will destroy it. Don't think I can make it, Arcana! Let me guide your actions. Open that hatch! Anything you put in there will totally scramble the machine circuits. Like what? Like your fist! Oh! Now, one well-aimed shot into that hole should finish it off. You gotta be kidding! It's the only weak spot if it's connected to the main brain circuit. Of course, if it isn't, we'll have to keep ripping off tentacles till we get it. Ah, the heck with it! Gort, ah! such swift devastation has never been committed against the Hive's machines before. Surely the Hive will be aware of it. So what? Let them! We can take them all out now! Can that be, Gort and Arcana? We must destroy them, Zarek! Exterminate! Exterminate! No, not yet. I wish to observe them. It could prove valuable for us. No sign of Hot Rod Cup and the others, Optimus Prime. Or the key to the plasma energy chamber. Something is terribly wrong here. Prime, where are you going? To get some answers. Now maybe we'll get some answers out of you, auto fools. Well, Blur, anything to say? You'll never make me talk, you dirty Decepticon rat. I'll never say a word, not a word, not a word. I'll never, 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 never talk. How about you, old-timer? Want to tell me where the key to the plasma energy chamber is? Ah, go stick your head in a black hole, Scourge! <laughs> Leave him alone, you slime ball! If you want to torture somebody, torture me! <laughs> go 
pull your cylinders, lad. I can take it. Yuck. Noble Autobots make me want to puke. You just love to waste your time, don't you, Scourge? What's that supposed to mean? Well, isn't it obvious? If any of these losers had the key, the other Autobots would be all over us by now. That's exactly where we are, Scourge! Five of you against all of us? You're mad! Oh, yeah? Headmasters, show them what you've got! Charge! What the devil? So that's where Gort and his rebels have been hiding. The heads of those metal beings become robotic exosuits. They're muscling onto our turf. I say we rub them out. Ah, but this development could be most useful to us. Prime, where are you going to get these answers you want? From the one who created me, from Alpha Trion. But he's in Vector Sigma, the computer which gave us all life. Right. And with the shell of the Matrix, I may be able to reactivate Vector Sigma and merge with it. gave us a pounding. And as long as they have the advantage of secondary operators, we will never regain the key to the plasma energy chamber. What now? <laughs> Me tired of being pushed around all the time. I am Zarak. I have a little deal to offer you. One which will enable you to defeat your adversaries. And all it will cost you is... your heads. The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. You get to defeat the Autobots, and we get new bodies in the form of robotic exosuits made from your heads. We don't make deals with organic creatures. You have no choice. All right. All right, we'll deal. How very wise of you. Just one thing. You can only have the heads of the animals. Huh? Still as you. You'll do as I say or you'll die. And what will you five offer us? Our weapons. You can modify them as you would the heads. A hive operator in a powerful weapon. Not such a bad idea. Well, enough bargaining. Remove your heads. Let the transformations begin. Alpha Trion. I've been expecting you, Optimus. Then you know why I've come. Nebulos. That which you seek is there. Nebulos? But how did Brainstorm and the others... Plasma energy. 
the chamber was opened momentarily, and a bolt of plasma energy struck their ship, sending them millions of miles into space. One bolt did all that? It is raw energy. It seeks out any entity that transforms matter into energy and overloads them totally. Only organic life is unaffected. But hear me, Prime. A second golden age of Cybertron is almost at hand. But whether this comes to pass depends on the merging of an Autobot's life with that of a human being. How do you know this, Alpha Trion? Vector Sigma itself. It was Vector Sigma who arranged for Galvatron to learn of the key's existence. Alpha Trion. That makes no sense. Do not question Vector Sigma's motives. The parameters of its thought matrix are greater than you can imagine. A final warning, Prime. Whatever happens, the key to the plasma energy chamber must not be destroyed. Vector Sigma commands it. Did you get your questions answered? Yes. And every answer led to a bigger question. But something's happening on Nebulos. The Decepticon modifications are complete, Lord Zarek. Excellent. Proceed to bond with them. I remain to work on a new plan, one which involves our entire city. You can't be leaving. I have no choice. The key is on Nebulos. Until I return, I'm leaving you in command. I know you won't let me down. We have real bodies. The boys are coming, nice stick. I hope you like busting heads. Yeah! I like busting Autobot headmasters better. I live only to destroy our mutual enemies. <laughs> I think the name Aimless suits you better. Hey, you can call me Caliburst, because I never missed a shot in my life. But you've never taken a shot in your life. See when I lie to you? Call me Blowpipe, because I want to blow those rebels away. <laughs> those Autobots are going to be molten metal. All right, knock it off. And what are my weapon? It's me, I'm Fracus. And if you think Blowpipe was bad, I'm worse. And you're louder. I am Spasma. And I am Crunk. You two better not get out of line with us, or we'll get mad. Yeah, we'll get mad. Uh, we'll see who's boss. Oh, me, a top hive scientist paired with a mangy night scavenger like you. The powers of darkness are a more powerful weapon than all the toys your science can muster. Now. Unite with me. Oh, yes, Master. I'm to be bonded to that creature? This project was a bad investment. Let us go. Hey, look! Cerebros, I found... A city. Well, at least his brain circuits are still alive. What was that city he mentioned? Maybe he found the lost city of the Hive, where they lived before they developed their mental powers and moved underground. Fellas, we've got company. Autobots, prepare to die! The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. Decepticon Target Masters, attack! <laughs> Decepticon 
Decepticon Headmasters destroy! Now they've got Headmasters too. Those creeps swiping my idea! I'll sue! Come on, you dumb monsters! You don't scare me! Whoa, now you scare me! Can't you hit anything, neighbors? What'd you expect? I knew it, this! Autobot Headmasters, let's butt heads with them! If I only had some energy-sensing equipment, we could easily find which one of them has the key! Bah! What need have I for your scientific toys? Will I have my extrasensory powers? That one! The key to the blast my energy chamber! Give it to me! Go hang upside down from a tree, my wife! Oh! We must find the key! Sarah commands it! The Headmasters and Target Masters, they are the Hive! The key! I have it! Ah, but I have you, Nightstick! You dirty rat! Let go of me! Arcana, activate my exoscanner! Run a full scan of his body! Wait, go, I tell you, let go! <laughs> you stinking punk, I'll get you for that! We have the key! Now let us destroy those accursed Autobots! No, no! We gotta get back to the Hive City! Zara commands it! Never! Not until every last Autobot is a smoking pile of rubble! I don't care about your petty feud! I obey Zarek! We go! Now! Very well, Fracas, but this argument's not over yet. They're getting away! And they've got the key! We've got to follow them! Forget it. They can fly and you guys can't. But the key! Ah, you're forgetting one crucial thing. They can't get off this planet any more than we can. Besides, I've got something that'll help us get the key back. This is how they did it. This is how the Hive modified the Deceptor Creep's guns. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Six rebel sharpshooters? Six Autobots. Let's do it. Well, what do you know? Spike, how's it coming? It's done. Optimus Prime, I want you to meet some friends of mine. I don't see anybody. Show him, Cup! Hi, I'm Recoil. Sure heard a lot about you, Optimus Prime. That's not all, not all by a long shot, not by a long shot, no, sir. I'm called Haywire, and I can nail a deceptor creep at 4,000 yards. Ha <laughs> ha, you bet. They call me Peacemaker. Spoil sport's the name, and there ain't a target I can't hit. <laughs> I'm Penpointer, and I'm an even better shot than he is. And I'm Firebolt. We are the Target Masters. And we're all Headmasters now, Prime. Watch! How did this all happen? It's a long story, Prime, with a couple of hitches in it. Yeah, the Decepticons are Headmasters and Target Masters, too. And they've got the key. Then let's get it back. This is absurd! We're wasting time here! You will wait. Zarak's modifications are nearly finished. If I have to wait any longer, I'm gonna bust a gasket! Why wait? I'll be happy to bust it for you, Trigger Happy! You dare challenge us after the humiliation we served on you last time? Nothing you served up could ever humiliate an Autobot, Scourge. Annihilate them! Autobot Target Masters! Let them have it! I think we're in trouble! Blast them, Spoil Sport! With pleasure, Sure Shot! Scourge has the key! Come on! Give it to me, Scourge! 
Good work, R.C. And this time you won't get it back, Deceptic Creeps! You are wrong. Sarak did it! What? Lasers? Autobots, prepare to feel the sting of Scarpanak! The Transformers will return after these messages. Exciting episode of the Transformers. Galvatron transports Cybertron itself into Earth's orbit. There, he opens the deadly plasma energy chamber and the sun begins to go nova. While on the distant planet Nebulos, Spike races against time to create a super headmaster that can defeat the Decepticons once and for all. The fate of the Autobots, Cybertron, and Earth hangs in the balance. But who will survive the most titanic Transformer battle ever? Find out in the Earth-shattering conclusion of The Transformers Rebirth.